Hello from Socky in Quick Manishire. I'm outside Beachwood Park, home of Socky Juniors. Now, if this is Scotland League Premier Division, it's Socky Juniors versus Lancaster. Yo, welcome to Beachwood Park. You can go to the back of the shop there. Ah, it's a bit wet today. Um, listen, I'm not going to do any walk around because I'll, I'll put a link to the game. It was uh, last season, Socky versus um, Oakley, and it was a good game. I think it was about five goals. And uh, it was the evening, and I thought we'd come today, hopefully get a nice view because it's, you get some lovely views here. <laughs> but uh, the weather's a bit grim. But the pitch is playable, and uh, I, I like the stand here and uh, the enclosure over there. One of the better grounds, I think, in the East of Scotland League. It was good seeing you doing all your tactics here. Is that a, a different tactics today for the game? Um, no, we've kind of we're kind of sticking with the same sort of stuff that we do all the time. We're kind of um, just getting the ball done as much as we can. The formation of the team isn't really changing too much. A um, couple of bodies back today, which is a wee bit more pleasing for us. Yeah. Um, good to see a couple of boys get back on, and even Brian Morgan getting back on the bench. So that's great for oh, us. Good. Um, we're only really kind of missing maybe a two or three now. So hopefully the next two or three weeks we can try and kind of clear a few of the injuries up. But no tactics wise, we work on the same stuff all the time. Get the ball in the day, pass the ball as much as we possibly can, um, into strikers at nice and early doors, and get ourselves forward. So. And I always think like a team. Lunker to you, they've not the best of starts in that relegation zone. Aye. They're always a danger though, aren't they? No, of course they are, because the, these teams, not, you know, this this league, these teams are they're always the same. It's very, very difficult in this league. Anybody can beat anybody. So, Lunker, they'll be fighting, they're fighting for their lives. They'll be wanting to have another crack at it. So, listen, we'll have to be very careful with them. Very, very careful. We'll have to be at the top of our game. Thank you very much, Fraser. <laughs> Since the last time I spoke to you, you've been promoted to, to manager. Did you bring anything else uh, to the team, or is it carrying on from the, the work before? Just carrying on. It's a different scenario now. Um, boys have been brilliant. It's just a case of now trying to get results on this board. Um, so no, it's really just a case of different chapter in my my career certainly. So no, it's just really um, trying to install hard work and get results on this on this board so yeah nothing really much changed and i would think the teams that are you know like i mean obviously you're, you're in that relegation zone but i would think you're more dangerous to opposition because you need to win uh, yeah you know, you'll be still that in your players that's we've certainly I mean. got a lot to play for still got a lot to prove um a few hard luck stories but um, i'm pretty sure we'll overcome them um Last week was a sore one to take for being down a man for so long in the game. But I thought the boys were exceptional. Um, so today will be a different task as well. So I'll get a good outfit. So we'll just have to be on our, our toes again today. Hi, my name's John. Um, we've been coming to Socky for, what, about the past 10, ten, ten years or something? Yeah. Yeah. Um, 15. Eh? 10, 15 years. Time flies, something. isn't it? <laughs> yeah, time definitely does fly, aye. Um, he's got more memory than me. Um, obviously, we're playing Lancarte today. Um, made the three points. Hopefully, fingers crossed we can get it. Um, obviously, doing a few players. Um, we'll be missing Big Scotty and obviously Morgy as well. Um, I think I think we can beat them today. I think um, three points are no a definite. No, but, never is. No, um, but I think we've got the players and everything on all that. We can get we'll grab the three points today. My name is George Dill. I'm a fan. Been a fan for 15 years. Um, Looking forward to the game today. Hopefully, get a win. Uh, wish the lads all the best. Yeah. I know it's the rain's uh, just eased off a bit, so uh, that, that'll be, uh, that'll be uh, good. A bit of rain, but don't mind. Yeah. We'll play them, we'll them work. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so. I think the last time I was here, uh, it was evening, and uh, I'm told you get some lovely views. Well, <laughs> we can just see a wee bit of the hills there in the background. Uh, it has cleaned up a wee bit, but uh, not enough to get, um, get a nice view there. Oh, they've got some lentil soup. Just a pound. Very good. 
I'm going to enjoy that. There we go, there's a bit more of that lovely view. It's still a bit low clouds, but lovely rocker holes. Oh, there's the uh, coming out. And there's the uh, fucky guys coming out. And the usual red. Well, there's kick off, uh, socket kick off. It's cleared up a bit now, it's, uh, I wouldn't say blue sky, but lighter sky. <laughs> and uh, it's, it's not been raining for a good half hour, hour or something. Well, first attack there, it's been shot there, but it's off target. <laughs> Oh, 
if you follow me. Oh, good effort. Brothers, one's man United, one's man City. So, what do you think of the first stuff, then, guys? Good? Uh, uh, pretty good. Good stuff. There you go. Hey, right, there'll be arguments in that, how you all do. Social media, yeah? Yeah, so I do all the, the live updates uh, during the game and obviously kind of hype the game up during the week. Try to get people along and that's about it, really. Um, and you do the graphics as well, because uh, so thanks for allowing me to use some of your graphics here. No, absolutely. I do all the graphics and that, and we're bringing out a new graphics package going into the, the new year, so you'll be able to use them when you come over. Is it, is it Facebook and Twitter? And... Yeah, so we're on Facebook, Twitter, uh, probably about to expand again to maybe Instagram, I don't know, maybe yeah. TikTok, the younger ones seem to be on that. But it's very important because people who kind of make the game, they, they, they might be wanting to see the updates and they get the updates as, as, as they happen. Yeah, definitely. People that obviously don't get to the games, you know, it's, it's for them. Um, also, people that, you know, we do have supporters like further abroad, you know, yeah. abroad Canada, Australia, um, you know, expats and things. So, giving, right. the, giving them the, the updates as well. 
Okay, well, thanks. So. Let's freeze off. Oh, I think uh, Lunker will be hoping there's a game with two halves. Uh, uh, Lunker is scanning through their lines. Um, a lot of times uh, the passes are just going to stray off back to the soccer guys. And uh, I think if I've had a shot at goal, I'll have to look back. They've had a, a few sort of I wouldn't mean, even call them chances, half chances, uh, a few attacks, but really they have to improve. So, will it be a game of two halves? We'll see. You guys will be pleased with the, the first half, eh? 3 0. Definitely. Right. Looking good. Good to be mayor. Good to be mayor. Um, Good to be mayor. Um, so hopefully the second half is going to be a couple of minutes. Aye, well, what you didn't want is uh, Lunker to get a, an early goal, eh? No, right. definitely. Because that could give them the confidence to fight back, you know? Mm. Okay, guys. There we go, there's a kick off second half there, and the full lights are on. I know this Oh, you love 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 Not a sight from a corner from the uh, Lunker there. Oh, oh, oh,
So I came back up then. My favourite player scored the goal. Good. Across. Who's your favourite player then? That Ross Cava Cava. Ross Cavanagh. Ah, oh, he's a really good player. So good. Yeah, it was a really good game, and I'm happy that we got the win. That makes me like really happy to see him score. Good stuff. Thank you. Right, you'll be pleased with our four-two victory of the day, eh? Aye, absolutely. Um, I thought we played really well uh, throughout the full game. We moved the ball well, created a lot of chances, and uh, probably could add a few more. Um, but I happy with the four goals. I think what was good as well is that the, a lot of the squad are back, so there's a lot of substitutions as well. Yep. Uh, but there's always a danger that it changes the game a wee bit, you know? No, no, absolutely. It was brilliant to get boys back, especially Morgie. Um, he's been out with a, a broken shoulder, so good to get him some minutes and then some of the other boys that came on as well. But I thought when they came on, didn't really change much. I thought they all came in, 
fit seamlessly into it and just kept building on it as well. So, aye, we're, we're in a good position now. I think we struggled the last few months yeah. with injuries, but we're now starting to get back into a, a full squad. So, I think it's a good position to be in. It was good to see you, not just on the south bench, but getting a wee bit game time. Aye, it's good to get, I think the game kind of went alright, it kind of gave me a, a few minutes to the end there, so it was good to get back in, in amongst it. I've been out for so long, it's quite chill, kind of out in the, out in the wilderness a wee bit, so I'd like to see it back in about the boys and the dunes and everything else. Aye. Were you up before? Were you happy with, with how you played? <laughs> a bit rusty, like, a couple of good boys and that, but I gave away a couple of slack passes, but yeah. the fitness is here, but it's the sharpness. Yeah. And I've been training in the gym for the last three weeks, like I said to you a couple of weeks ago, I think it was yeah. last week actually. So I've been in the gym doing rehab and stuff like that, but actually getting on the pitch is a different story. You can do all the, all the running and that you want, but getting a touch on the ball, and that's a different story, so I. Okay, well it's good to see you back. Thanks, Thanks very much. much Thanks right. Fraser, you'll be pleased with your uh, victory. Yeah. Maybe not the second half performance though. No, I think uh, we started the game really well. The first half we've been, out, we've been outstanding, we've passed the ball out really well, Katie chances. Got the goals, came in at half time. I said to the boys, it's important to try and keep that up. That, yeah. That's what we've been working on the last year, but we've been struggling to find that that kind of momentum. And I think when, we, when you go ahead in games so early, yeah. you can lose a wee bit of that. I think, I think a wee bit of kind of tiredness was creeping in and the conditions and that, so we started to kind of let Lonkarty back in the game. So. And of course, Lonkarty had to come out there in the right. second half. Yeah. And maybe if they'd got an earlier goal, it could have been, Aye. you know, but, but I, I still thought you defended well. Aye, I always I always felt, to be honest with you, I always felt we were in control of the game. I never felt at any stage where I thought to myself, well, we're going to lose control of this game here. Because I, I always felt that even if, kind of, when Lonkarty scored, when they scored their second goal, yeah. I always felt, felt we kind of stepped up a wee bit and we kept the hold of the ball for a long period of time. So that kind of, kind of stifled them a wee bit. But, no, I'm delighted with the three points. Like I said, that's another three points on the board for us. So we've just got to keep plodding away and see what happens. And you'll be delighted that uh, you're able to bring on quite a lot of subs, including Brian. That was his first game for Aye, a while. That's his first game for a long time. So we've, we've, we've kind of got a few boys back today. So we've managed to get them on the park and get good minutes at them. So it's important now, I've said that to them for next week, they go and rest up again and just try and get the wee niggles away and then kick on into January. Great stuff, thank you. Bitch,